Welcome to a free tutorial from WordLearningZone.com. I'm your instructor, Richard Rost. In this lesson, I'm going to teach you how to work with styles in Microsoft Word. What are styles? Essentially, a style is a set of formatting instructions for text. By using styles, especially in large documents, you can create a professional and consistent look and feel throughout your document. Here I am inside of Microsoft Word. I'm using Word 2003. And I've created a sample document. Let's say I'm writing a story. I've got three chapters. Chapter 1, Chapter 2, Chapter 3. Now normally, if I wanted to change the look and feel of these chapter headings, I could come in here. I could change the font. Change the font size. Bold it. Center it, for example. But then if I want to do the same thing to all the different chapters, I have to go through and change each one. Now there is a tool called the Format Painter, which is right here, that I can then select them this way with the Format Painter. However, I still have to go through, if I've got 35 chapters, I still have to go through the entire document and select all the different chapter headings. Well, let's undo all that. Undo, 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 undo. Okay, here I am back to square one. Now if I use a style, for all these chapter headings. Then if I want to make a change, I simply change one thing and it updates all the different chapter headings. For example, let's highlight chapter one here. Here's the style drop down box. Now right now you can see it's normal plus 11 point. It's normal, meaning the default normal style. And before I started recording this video, I set the font down to 11 points. So I'm gonna drop this down there are a bunch of built-in headings and styles that you can use. I'm just going to pick Heading 1. There we go. There's Chapter 1 in the Heading 1 style. I'll do the same thing for Chapter 2. Heading 1. I'll scroll down and change Chapter 3 to Heading 1. And there we go. Now these are the built-in styles that come with Word. Here's the major benefit of using styles now. If I want to make a change, let's say I want to center all these and make them blue. All I have to do is modify the style and it'll change all the chapter headings throughout the document. I can modify the style by clicking on this little button right here that says Styles and Formatting. And that will bring up the Styles and Formatting task pane. Right here is my heading 1. I'm going to click on this little down arrow next to it. Drop that down. And I'll pick Modify. Okay, I'm going to modify my style, heading 1. Let's say I want to make the style 18 point, a little bit bigger. Centered on the page. And let's make the text. Let's pick, uh, I could pick red, I'm going to pick blue. I'll come down here and click on OK. And now notice in my document, all of my chapter headings are now larger, centered, and blue. And all I had to do was simply change the style that they're associated with. That's the major benefit of using styles. And there are, of course, lots of other benefits to using styles. I cover all those benefits and all the different features of styles in my Microsoft Word 203 tutorial. It's an hour-long tutorial and I cover mostly styles throughout the entire course. I'll talk about using the built-in Word styles, how to modify those in more detail, of course. There's lots of different options in there. I'll talk about creating new styles, how to make your own styles. You can change paragraph styles. There are things called character styles, even table and list styles and I'll go into all these different things in detail in my tutorial series. You can of course find out lots more on my website at wordlearningzone.com. Now if you're interested in purchasing any of my tutorials, go to this special page wordlearningzone.com slash YouTube to get a 25% discount on any courses you purchase.